Hey there, Star Seekers. Welcome back to Star Scoop. I'm not sure how long that will endure. Viewers were taken aback when the split occurred last year after more than 10 years of depicting a happily ever after on TV. Kyle says that she and Mariko had a wonderful marriage before things took a bad turn last year. About what Kyle has shared, she doesn't say that Mauricio and her split up because of a major event, but she does talk about a turning point where the straw broke the camel's back. She was prompted to call it and request a separation by that unreported incident. I was always very proud of the fact that we were able to grow together in all the years of our marriage, she recalls, and I think it got to a point where he was so busy, and I'm working, and we weren't necessarily growing together. And I think that's when the problems that we had sort of put on the back burner started to bubble up again. The death of her childhood friend Laureen Shea, who committed herself in 2022, served as a trigger for what has turned out to be a season of transition for Kyle. She has been sober for more over a year and has really focused on her health and fitness. Regarding what makes her happy these days, she says, I hate to say it like this, cause it sounds so almost selfish, but really just working on myself. Working on myself is taking care of myself physically, emotionally, and really digging very deep and learning a lot about myself. And with that means where I go, where I spend my time, who I spend it with and in that, I'm finding joy. And it doesn't look like it used to. It may seem cliche to say that losing someone truly puts things into perspective, but Laureen was the closest person to me. I believe that after losing her and witnessing her struggle, I truly did consider what truly matters in life. After all, we are only here for a short while. With whom would you like to spend time? You also want to feel appreciated because every day is unique. This season on Housewives, Kyle organized an event in honor of Laureen in collaboration with the National Alliance for Mental Health, NAMI, during which she shared her need to feel appreciated by the people in her life. Many saw that as a jab at Mauricio, who was unable to attend the charity event because of work commitments. Though Kyle has since clarified that his absence was due to a scheduling conflict, the feeling is still there. Yes, I did go through phases where I thought, why is our relationship not as important as work? Which I'm sure many women feel that, and I know he has a very important job, and not just with his work, 
but he has a big family to take care of and support, so it's not like it's all on him or all on me, you know. She replies, I'm just careful about how I word it and what I say, because I do care about him so much and have a tremendous amount of respect for him and what we built, and I don't want to damage that by talking about it negatively. Ka wasn't prepared to shout her personal issues from the rooftops, that is, into the mic pack she wears while filming for part of the reason. You know, we had not shared with our daughters yet what was really going on, so it felt strange to put that on television before sharing that with them, she says, but I didn't have a say in when the season started. Thanks for tuning into this edition of Star Scoop. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss out on the latest celebrity buzz.